Americo Lopez resigned from his job after manipulating the $17,133,166 Mega Millions jackpot prize he received. Along with five colleagues, they had been contributing funds for lottery tickets for years. In November 2009, Lopez collected their money and purchased a winning ticket without informing his co-workers. When Carlos Fernandez and Candido Silva Jr. discovered the deception, they sued Lopez, revealing he used their pooled funds for the winning ticket. Lopez claimed the jackpot alone, leaving his job under the pretense of needing foot surgery. His colleagues only learned of his win when he confided in a friend from the lotto pool after quitting. Co-workers sued Lopez in 2010, leading to a freeze on the winnings. In 2012, a jury ruled that Lopes had to share the jackpot with his former colleagues, who felt betrayed by his actions. During the trial, Lopes insisted he bought the winning tickets separately from the pool tickets, and his lawyer argued the lack of documentation made it uncertain who paid for the winning ticket. Co-workers, however, emphasized trust and betrayal. In a similar incident, McDonald's employee Mirland Wilson faced a lawsuit from colleagues who accused her of attempting to keep a $105 million Mega Millions jackpot to herself. Wilson claimed she bought the winning tickets separately, but her co-workers disputed this, leading to a legal battle. Wilson later claimed to have misplaced the ticket, and three other Maryland residents came forward with the winning ticket. These stories highlight the potential pitfalls of lottery pools, where trust can be shattered by a member claiming a jackpot for themselves, leading to legal disputes and strained relationships among colleagues. Americo Lopez's departure from his job unfolded as a result of a calculated deception that shook the foundation of trust among his New Jersey colleagues. After accumulating a substantial 17,433,966 mega-millions jackpot, Lopez, along with five friends who had collectively contributed funds for lottery tickets over an extended period, found themselves entangled in a web of deceit. In November 2009, Lopez, entrusted with the pooled funds, took a decisive turn by purchasing a Mega Millions ticket without the knowledge of his co-workers. When the ticket turned out to be the jackpot winner, he strategically kept the news confined to himself and discreetly claimed the substantial prize through lottery officials. Shortly thereafter, Lopes abruptly left, left his job citing the need for foot surgery, a reason that his colleagues accepted at face value. However, the truth began to unravel several months later. A fellow participant in the lotto pool, Candido Silva Jr., learned from Lopez that he had won the jackpot merely a week after leaving his job. This revelation triggered suspicion among the co-workers, leading to a gradual realization of Lopez's multi-million dollar secret. In 2010, Lopez faced legal action as Carlos Fernandez and Candido Silva Jr. sued him for diverting the winnings. The situation escalated, resulting in a freeze on the lottery winnings.